to do Little Lift Fam. It's your boy D. I'm Taryn. And Jay. And, and welcome, welcome back, back to another, another video. video. Let's go. It's the flights in the city and I'm about to take off. And I'm about to take off. It's the flights in the city and I'm about to take off. All right, guys. So as you know, we've had three giveaways so far. We still have one more going. It starts today. The only thing that's different about this one is it ends a little bit early. 11.59 on the 31st is the last last time to get your entry in and we will announce on the 1st of January 2021. Sir. Who the three Ooh. winners are. Yes, three winners. three winners and the post will be here somewhere on the screen along with the rules so go tap in and see if you can win. Okay, so for our last video of the year, I feel like I can say that, yeah, so our, for our last video of the year mm -hmm. we said we were doing a Q&A. We haven't done a Q&A in Probably like a, a year. Years. What is like two years? So we're doing, we're back with another <laughs> Q&A. You guys asked us some questions. We've had questions from the past that we're mm -hmm. answering. So we just put like our best questions that like Little If has ever received mm -hmm. into like our notes and we're gonna be answering them today. Before we jump into the video, make sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Especially subscribe. Subscribe, subscribe, because we're still trying to hit that thousand. This is gonna be the last video of the year. So, so get us there. Close. Exactly. So close. I feel like we got like a little bit like like 60 subscribers left. We hit our Instagram. Yeah, Instagram. We hit, Shout yo, out to y'all. Yo, 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 come on. 4K, come on. 4K baby. Now we need our YouTube to get up there, so exactly. definitely, definitely. Let people know to subscribe to our channel. I'm about to go dummy, guys. But let's jump into this Q&A. Our very first question, how did the brand start? This question is a very, very, very highly requested question. The brand started actually um, from just Jay and I's love for fitness just over time in college. Gained a lot of weight, freshman 15, freshman like 30 for us, really. Right. So like we was going to the gym a lot, we had like a change in just mindset from going to the gym a lot. So. One day in the car, we literally just sat down and was just like, yo, we feel really good about our mindset and how we change, so we right. want to give that back to other people. So we came with Little Live just to basically inspire and motivate people just to live a healthy lifestyle, just be better people. On to the second question. Number what two. do you guys do in real life? I feel like people wonder this a lot. Yeah, for sure. Like yeah. Individually, first of all, like I just wanted to put that out there. We all do different things. Yeah. Like Let's Lift is something that we do together. Right. Fitness is the love that we all have. But mm -hmm. again, we do have individual lives. We do individual things. For me, personally, I just started being an electrical apprentice in the local electrical union, 103. Cool gig, just something new, just to switch it up. I am also still working on my personal training license, but yeah. That's me. I work at Tufts Children's Hospital. I'm a clinical care technician in the bone marrow transplant unit there on the weekends. And then during the weekdays, I'm a full-time student also at Tufts um, University, the medical school. And I'm in med my, <laughs> not in med school though, but I'm in the MBS program, which is my master's of biomedical science. On the road to med school. Yeah, yeah. hopefully it'll get me into Soon med school. Soon we'll be there. <laughs> um, and me, I am a full-time personal trainer. I work at an all-women's gym here in Boston. Um, I've been there for, mm -hmm. yeah, health works, yeah, yeah. I've been there for <laughs> two years. And yeah, that's that's really that's my full time job, and I'm a dog da a dog dad. Oh, me too. Dog well. mom and dad. Yeah. She's a dog, dog mom. I'm a dog dad part time. <laughs> okay, question number three: Do you guys offer personal training? Yeah, you would think we do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> to be honest, okay, okay. So quick rundown. Um, like we said, the brand has been alive for four years. It has come a long way in four years. We tried to do programs couple years ago. I don't think we had as much experience and knowledge into the programs mm -hmm. as we would have wanted. So we were thinking about just doing like one-on-one -on -one training, but in Boston, it's just tough because you have to go to gyms where you, you need to be a trainer at those gyms. Exactly. You can't just be a trainer off the streets, like training people at Planet Fitness or Crunch, which is our, in our neighborhood. Um, we so, tried. Yeah, times. we definitely tried. We, exactly. We, we got tried. in trouble for it. Exactly. And <laughs> so. we, we did help people on their fitness journey for mm -hmm. sure. Yeah. Um, but we realized just long term that wouldn't be something that's sustainable. So we stopped doing that. So once again, long story short, we do not currently offer any personal training. Uh, question number four, how often do y'all work out? Ooh, great question. That is a great question. See, you got this. <laughs> so I can only answer for myself, but it's just not very much. I really was trying at the beginning of my semester. I was actually like getting up at like 6 a.m. and going to the gym with my friend Ashanti every day. You know, it was going really well, but it got really hard in school and I missed a few 
and then I've lately been having some back issues. You know, we're working with what we can do. I'm trying to get some yoga in there, do some stretching, but I haven't really worked out in like at least a few weeks. I'll go next. I was gonna say, this question would vary if you ask this in another year. I definitely think like so this year was tough for all of us, this COVID. So a lot of times we were doing home workouts and that's already like very hard to get motivated to just roll out of bread and want to do like a workout in your room or in the right. living room, whatever. But I'm not going to make that as an excuse. I would say I work out maybe like three times max a week. Yeah, for me, honestly, since like I've started this new job, I haven't right. really been able to get in the gym as often as I'd like. Um, I'd even be lucky to get in like a day in the week, just one day during the week, to be honest, believe it or not. I've been trying, <laughs> just right. like T, I've been trying to get in there, but again, like, life is taking its toll, right. people are tired, you know what I'm saying, fatigue, all that stuff, you wanna keep your mental health there, so I've been trying to get in at least one day a week. If not one day a week, I definitely do a home workout at least one day a week, Also so. preface that you, do a lot of walking. Oh like, yeah, yeah, you, yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, you're, like, you're, yes, you're yes, doing yes, a lot. Thank you, Jay, thank you. Yeah, I was like, yes, definitely yes. say that. Like, <laughs> as my job is very taxing, I do right. like manual labor basically. So like, I'm moving up and down the building that I'm working at right exactly. now constantly, like 24/7 basically. So I'm burning at least like a thousand to a thousand five hundred calories a day. No, but yeah. I think it is good for us to really kind of just say real quick, just that it's not all about working out. Like we're pushing this, yeah. like we're telling you guys about like working out and fitness and showing you our workouts and showing you what we eat and all that stuff, whether it's through our IG or YouTube, but like we're really just about like staying active, staying good, physically, mentally, everything. Like I'm not upset when T doesn't go to the gym. I hope T's not upset when she doesn't go to the gym. Same for Darren. Like, I we, wish she was more upset when I did. No, but I, I think no. like I think like life <laughs> happens, and I think you can't beat yourself up about going to the gym. Like Darren, sure. Darren said, yeah. he gets a thousand calories in, and he's not even going in the gym. Like he's literally not stepping. And in I the definitely gym. and I definitely feel different because from in the past went to the gym later like four times to five times even during the exactly. week to now not even going at all. It's kind of like the switch up for me. It's like okay, mentally like I have to know that okay, Darren, you're doing other things to get right. your, your right. calories in. You right. know what I'm get your calories burned so right. don't even you know what i'm saying focus on not going to the gym and stuff like that because i do miss lifting weights i do miss you know what i'm saying the gym in itself but the gym is closed now COVID again right. so it's just like certain things is kind of like give or take with exactly. how just life is moving right now really. right yeah, that was good that was good um when are you guys traveling again so Ooh. personally i Definitely in 2021. Yeah, facts. Um, <laughs> We're all hoping to travel. Literally, <laughs> so honestly. JetBlue had this thing going for um, essential workers facts. at the beginning of the pandemic where they were, you know, you enter contest, people can um, nominate you, and then you can win a free flight for you and another person anywhere that they fly to. So don't tell JetBlue, but I won that twice. <laughs> Two, times. Two times. So I get to bring my lovely boyfriend somewhere next year. And then I'm also gonna bring my friend Ashanti somewhere. So I plan on having two trips in 2021 because I deserve it. <laughs> but well deserved. Lift to lift wise, um, traveling, I don't know. Right. Not really sure. You know, it's not really on our front burner right now. Um, if anything, we'll do some kind of local outreach or right. local community service. Because as you know, the last trip that Let's Live took was to Haiti, and you guys ate that up. You loved that it. Video, it was like a three -part that series. video is getting more numbers. Brought up. No problem. Yo, exactly. Nice. If you haven't go, haven't seen that video, go see it. Yeah. There'll be a card on the screen somewhere Facts. above our heads. Facts. Go check that video out. Sure. Part one, two, and three. And, and we've had people oh, ask when, oh. you know, D is the one that went, but when Let's Lift is coming back, and we don't know, you know, the Let's right. Set project was the one that headed that, exactly. and maybe they're gonna go again, maybe we'll hop on, but not sure yet. When are you guys dropping merch again? For the next year, 2021, we're trying to do something a little bit different. We're, we're doing drops. So we're planning on doing a couple drops throughout 2021. Obviously, summer will definitely be one, and maybe one for the fall, winter. So that's what we kind of have planned as for like merch. Obviously, we not gonna tell you what the product is yet. Mm -hmm. But Stay go comment and let us know what you what wanna you, see because nothing's set in stone yet. Exactly, right, right exactly. Right. Um, yeah, we're always up for ideas, guys, so definitely comment Facts. down below. Right. Shoot us a DM, whatever, guys, really, honestly. Whatever you guys want to be in, we want to make that for you, so. 
hundred percent. Let us know. Let us know. Like D said, we are doing drops for our merch. So that means that when we're not doing a drop or you know, we're not selling anything at the moment, our Shopify Litsalift.com is not gonna be open. Right. So if you go and type in www.litsalift.com, you're not gonna see anything there unless we actually have some merch being sold. There might be like a message that says like come back soon or something. Like right. under construction. It, under con um what do you guys do for fun outside of the business? I don't do much. I don't do much. <laughs> like I said, it's a good question, but like, no, we're literally, I feel like yeah. I'm with the same people. I'm with D, I'm with Ashanti, I'm with yeah. T. That's Richard. it, and Richard, that's it. That's, that's literally it. the people, and my dog. That's literally what we do. Okay. I think this question, once again, if it wasn't this year, would be very different, but because it is this year, what are we doing? I'm not outside, I'm not doing <laughs> what, I'm, are we what are we doing? I'm playing video games. If you wanna know what I do outside of this, I'm playing video Play games. Video I play game. Apex and some Modern Warfare. That's what I do. But yeah, really. So it's just video games and chilling with my loved ones. That's really it. Um, I also don't really do much. I don't really have time outside of school. When I'm not in school, I'm kinda working. Um, so I hang out with them, my dog, a lot of puppy time and my roommate Richard and my friend Ashanti. It's kind of like a little circle. Facts. With That's COVID, you shouldn't really be branching yeah. out anywhere. <laughs> right, yeah, same answer that they was basically saying. I literally chill with them and my girl Ashanti. Facts. That's it. That's it. We're boring. Uh, second to last question. Where do you guys see Lit to Lift in five years? Mm -hmm. I like that question. What is that, 2025? 2025. Hopefully monetized on YouTube. Oh, yeah. Yes. Just gonna throw that one out yes, there. Yes, I love that. I don't know. I see Lit to Lift getting more into their niche. Hopefully, um, building our followers towards people who want to see content specific to Lit to Lift. Mm -hmm. um, I know a lot of our followers now are like our loved ones who want to support us, and that's amazing. Mm -hmm. But to grow, you need to find people that want what you're providing. So I hope, you know can really grow in that way and big on the monetize on YouTube. Right, for sure. I think in five years, I just really hope that we're getting paid our worth. That's in five years, for sure. I hope we're getting paid our worth. I hope we're still as strong, still able to access, access each other to get content and things like that. Um, and yeah, I just hope we're still giving back to the community, doing what we do. Everything that we're doing now, I just want it to be tenfold and right. getting paid our work. That's the main thing. Same. And hopefully we're enjoying ourselves as what, right. like 29 right. and 30 right. year olds. That's true. That's like, true. We'll yeah. have That's two personal so trainers, right. a med student, like it's gonna be, it's gonna, gonna be a change. Time. Looking to having kids. Yeah, that's like, gonna be a time. Yeah. Wow, that's that is wild, crazy. Right? That is wild. And y'all gonna be seeing the whole thing. Literally. Think about it. About to be vlogging. Think about it. Five years, we're gonna be vlogging the next five <laughs> years. That's different. What? Different. Subscribe. <laughs> <laughs> All right, last question. Last question. Um, what's in store for 2021? Ha, the new year. What's yes, in store sir. for 2021? Well, for first, obviously, you guys know merch. Merch. Merch drops merch. are definitely coming to Exactly. We did one this year. Yeah, one. Just we one. finally back. Yeah. And it was back. Uh, wait, we didn't even say how like that went. Well, we sold out, all thanks to you guys. Like, we were able to sell out the first batch, restock, and then exactly. sell out the next one. Exactly. Um, so shirts went really, really well. Yeah. Um, overall. Yeah. So like, I'm very happy for 2021 to see like how the merch will, the merch drops will go because we have some things up our sleeves for sure. For sure. Um, um, I think for 2021, we are definitely gonna try to go into like I'm saying like the training type realm, mm -hmm. um, maybe in the form of like a boot camp type style right. in the summer or stuff like that. you know what I'm saying. So we've been talking about stuff like that kind of for 2021. Nothing yet set in stone, but right. definitely, definitely look out for something similar to that. For 2021, we're trying to add a new segment to our YouTube channel, something different, something very, very new. And hopefully you enjoy it. Yeah, we think you guys will enjoy it. We're yeah, definitely going to enjoy it. We're guys, definitely going to enjoy it. We're definitely going to enjoy it. Facts. Sure. Yeah, well, everybody was told it about it. Seems pretty excited about it. Yeah. So, mm -hmm. you know. So definitely stay, stay tuned out. for that. Like, yo. Subscribe. <laughs> also, sure. obviously, new content. Right. More nuanced content as we learn, you know, as Instagram changes, as, you know, all these platforms so change. Changes, so do we. Exactly. We right. have to, you know, roll with all Facts. the punches. So maybe... I don't know, more no, I like that. I like. I think that's a great one because I think like our content kind of even like how do like ads work? Um, how to get right, your first right. thousand exactly. YouTube subscribers? How to hit four thousand on Instagram? There's little things like that. We might make a video on those stuff mm -hmm. because we do want to be more transparent with you guys. We do want to let you guys in because it's taken us a while to grow and 
once again, we want to be relatable. We want people to actually feel like they can do this too and like figure out the route to this and all that. So like T said, definitely new content, definitely different sure, things. Sure. Um, but yeah, 2021 is going to be a year. We're so blast. excited. Yeah, we're, we're, we're going to be so much more than this year. Yes, because mm -hmm. this this year showed us that we could do a lot. Yeah, like we, we dropped merch. We dropped merch again. We did some corporate workouts, which is a new bag that we've never volunteer really dabbled twice. in. Yeah. Vol exactly, volunteer twice. Mm. Like this year was nuts. This year was nuts. We yeah, linked yeah. up. We linked up. We linked up with new people. We linked up. Yeah. Yeah. Got a whole some collabs new in. Home you know? video series going. And that's another thing I was gonna say for 2021. Definitely the home workout series. You guys have been loving it. So clearly it's something you guys want to see continue. So we're gonna keep rolling out the home workouts. We can't wait to like show you guys more videos, more stuff, cause it's it's our lives basically. Yeah. It's our lives. That's really what we're doing. Anyway, guys, we hope that you enjoyed this video, learned a little bit right, right. about us that hopefully, you didn't know. Hopefully. We want you to comment below. We want you to like this video, Please share do. it. Please. We want to hear your feedback. When we say comment, we don't mean like nice video. Yeah, right. just, like, exactly. Yo, just for the engagement. Exactly. Let us actually like, know how you know. feel. Let Facts. us know. Facts. Anyway, guys, happy holidays. Well, Merry Christmas more thing. or whatever holidays you we celebrate. celebrate. Exactly. Oh, all that. Oh, yeah. um, just so you guys know. Know, this will be the last video for this year and for a while actually um we are taking a break from youtube uh just recuperate you know what i'm saying get we right we do this every year so every don't year. be alarmed yes, well if you're a new subscriber right. you might be a little exactly, alarmed exactly. <laughs> but don't be alarmed overall we, we usually will be make back. it mad dramatic yeah, yeah we do <laughs> like last youtube yeah. we're not doing all that <laughs> yes we're not YouTube. doing all that we're not doing all that but we are leaving for a while just yeah. like d said for yeah. our mental health we like to relax to like take a break mm -hmm. not worry about content every week and all that and stuff. we need it so, yeah, for sure. You know saying? Like we were just saying, like we work hard with these vlogs, Facts. editing, all that stuff. Facts. So we can kind of take a break from this, focus on other content and other things that Lick to Lift needs. But um, yeah, like T said, yeah, yeah, yeah. that's like it. That was it. That's the we end out. of the video. That's it. We out. That's this wine's set. hitting. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> and this ring light got me. Yeah. Headbuster. Right. Go back to the giveaway. We Head love bus. you guys so much. Make sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe. As always. But we're out. Bye. Deuces. Somebody hit it. See you next year. Somebody hit it. Somebody hit it. Oh. Two. Three, two. But Sorry. <laughs> As you know, we've had three giveaways this month. Mm -hmm. Three of them. Three. And this past one, still ongoing, it ends, well. When they see it, so exactly so. Okay. Damn, that was 20. That's, That's wild, we just be chatting. Bro. We be chatting. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I be saying. That's what I be saying. <laughs> ah! <laughs> Damn, I slapped the shit out of you. <laughs> Jay slapped she slipped, the shit. She slipped it? No, 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 it was just like a, a drink. I knew she was getting lit. <laughs> anyway. <laughs>